Uh, hey, what's up? Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. I don't know when you will, will, you will be watching this. How are you guys feeling? I sure hope you are okay, you know. So, my mood's less terrible today. So, why not, you know, like, do a request, play a little. I feel like... I need to I need to apologize for the the Abernathy settlement episode. I wasn't really in a good headspace while not only recording but definitely while adding the adding <sighs> You guys know what I mean <laughs> what I'm trying to say here. Anyways um, I'm probably gonna vault that eventually, I don't know. As I'm recording this one, that isn't out yet, it will be tomorrow, I guess. Not sure what day is today, but uh, oh, hey Delilah, where is, where is Carlo then? She must be all the way up there. What was I saying? Oh, right, right. So, you know. Problem is, I don't really wanna, like, just get rid of it, you know. The thing is, I don't have the... What the hell? I don't have the... The original file anymore, so... Now the world don't move. Bad idea. Good riddance. Hey, something's out there. Yeah, more rats. If I saw them right. Free for the taking. Uh, and I lost my train of thought. Because, of course I would. <laughs> uh, okay. Why isn't marking on the map? Oh, because I'm already here. <laughs> Anyways, uh, I don't really wanna like not show you stuff, you know. For the uh, yikes! Wait right there. Ouch, 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 ouch. Sorry, Pepper. Hey, come on. Uh, Where'd they go? We just haven't come to that. But uh, I know, like, I wasn't in really a good mood or whatever, so, yeah. Yes. I'm still not in the best headspace, to be honest. But, uh... I'm starting to shake up a so bit. Heads up. Hmm? Piper. You know, I still really appreciate the fact that you're not an idiot. <laughs> uh. <sighs> Thanks. You too. No, I, I didn't mean like... <laughs> I could just use some help. This isn't the sort of thing I'd normally bother anyone else with, but you just seem really good with people, and I've got this issue with my sister, Nat. Becoming me. 
What do you mean? I'm coming you. What do you mean? I'm just terrified she's gonna start taking up like her big sis. I mean, think about the life we lead. No offense intended, Blue, but personal safety doesn't exactly seem like either of our strong suits. I can't have her ending up like her big sister. Dodging bullets and running from all the people she pisses off. It's part of the reason I'm on the road so much. Part of the reason I'm here with you. I keep thinking, maybe if I make myself scarce, if I'm not around her enough, she'll cool off. She'll just go back to being sweet, innocent Nat, paper girl, and all around upstanding citizen. What do I do, Blue? So... Yeah, both Chu and Farley things I would personally say. Hmm. You don't get to decide who Nat's gonna be, Piper. She does. All you decide is whether you want to be a part of her life or not. You're right. She's her own person and always will be. Thanks, Blue. Who'd expect wandering off with a stranger to turn out this well? They really don't make them like you anymore. <laughs> You're a hell of a friend, you know that? <laughs> the feeling's mutual, Piper. Ain't that the truth? But hey... Thanks again for listening. It's a real weight off my chest to be able to talk it out with someone. So, you wanna hit the road? Yep. So, this, I will fuck with this later. Right now, let me see what I wanna do. Let's go to Salem. Why not? Probably Piper is the best companion to have around for that. Anyways, as I was saying, I'm going through some chill, you know, in my, in my personal life. And I don't really want to bring bring it to to the channel, especially because I'm just targeting it. But uh, we were not alone here. Still in one piece. I can carry something if you need me to. Not right now. Ouch! Now. Motherfucker. I done between this thing and the exit all oh, right I never I actually haven't lost shit I just went there to to take a, a screenshot you know choose a thumbnail oh I also had talk with Preston that's it then I'm gonna retake the castle wasn't exactly what I had in mind for today but why not I need to stop fooling around and uh and uh do some stuff related to the uh, the main quest i mean hey Preston. hello ma'am i found out what those robots in gray garden needed and took care of it even better they want to be minutemen huh i guess i never thought of robots being minutemen but why not if they're willing I guess we can use them. Hey. Is there something you need? How are you feeling? I'm glad to have the chance to return the favor. After all the help you gave me. We've gotten big enough that we're having trouble communicating with all our settlements. It's a good problem to have. And I have a solution. I think it's time to retake the castle. It used to be the Minutemen HQ. Way before my time. Well fortified. Centrally located. And most important, 
It has a powerful radio transmitter we can use to broadcast to the whole Commonwealth. Mm. Sounds like just what we need right now. <laughs> I thought you'd like the idea. So, should I have an assault force assemble near the castle? Mm. So what happened? So what happened to this castle if it was so well fortified? This was long before I joined up. But the story I heard was that some kind of monster came out of the sea and destroyed the fort. So, should I have an assault force assemble near the castle? Sure. Yeah. Let's do this. We'll do some recon and meet you outside the castle. See you there. Yep, I'm gonna just change my clothes. This hat gives me protection, but it's a less fuck. Then? Oops. Wrong bench. If I remember correctly, I have we'll a bed find in what here. You are looking for. Yep, let's flip the game. It. Oh, speaking of which, come here, Roman Murphy. I'm afraid I'm not much use in a fight anymore. But back in the day, folks used to call me Murphy the Mad Woman. <laughs> hey, got that jet we talked about, kid? Mm, nope. You're an addict. You need help. Oh, not this again. Kid, listen to me. I'm old, even older than you'd think. If the Kims are gonna kill me, then I say I've had a good run. We'd have never made it this far without the sight. We need it. You need it. It's part of who I am. The sight isn't worth killing yourself over, Mama Murphy. It doesn't have to define what you are or what you can give. All right, kid, you got me. Nice. If me hanging around for a little longer is worth that much to you, then I'll go clean. No more chems, no more sight. Let me save the game Probably again. Off murder a pint. This'll do. So, you're not an idiot. Uh, thanks, I uh, guess. Thanks. I guess. No, I, I didn't mean like... I could just use some help. This isn't the sort of thing I'd normally bother anyone else with, but you just seem really good with people, and I've got this issue with my sister, Nat, becoming me. <laughs> I just want to see how, how she's going to react. Wait, become you? Like replace you oh is not a synth oh well there's <laughs> something i'm gonna lose sleep over for days but no not like a synth more like she's gonna start following in my perilous footsteps i mean think about the life we lead no offense intended blue no i'm thinking personal safety doesn't exactly seem like either of our strong suits i can't have her ending up like her big sister dodging bullets and running from all the people she pisses off it's part of the reason I'm on the road so much. Part of the reason I'm here with you. I keep thinking, maybe if I make myself scarce, if I'm not around her enough, she'll cool off. She'll just go back to being sweet, innocent Nat, paper girl, an all-around upstanding citizen. What do I do, Blue? Well, last time I, would, I went with you, let's go with four now. You just love her. Family's precious. The last thing you want to do is drive them away, because you might lose them forever. You're right. I can't risk that. Thanks, Blue. Who'd expect wandering off with a stranger to turn out this well? They really don't make them like you anymore. <laughs> You're a hell of a friend, you know that? <laughs> the feeling's mutual. feeling's mutual, Piper. Ain't that the truth? But hey, thanks again for listening. It's a real weight off my chest to be able to talk it out with someone. So... You wanna hit the road? Yep, we have a place to take over. Now, the castle is all the way down there. Mm. Do you know time it's nice? I can do both then. Uh, I won't say two birds with one stone, cause don't hurt. Please don't hurt. Birds. Yeah. Carla. Hey there. 
Trading? Uh, sure. I'll take a look. Sure. Always happy to make a sale. Yeah, I bet you are. Give me. Ooh, I don't have much money. Um, know what? Fuck it, I can make more of this. And this. Now, give me all your demo. What else do you have for me? Let me see. I have been popping this left and right. Okay. Uh, this, this, this. Yep, that's a little too much. Ooh. Maybe. Nice, nice, nice. Can I make perfect? Uh, now, right here, grenades. What's the difference between those two? If you <laughs> maybe someday, maybe someday. Wanted to make me a second printing press while you're at it. No. Oh, I have three levels stocked up. Uh, what's my window? Go with red resist. Ten, ten. Now I'm gonna fuck with a Marler Queen and a shitload of Marlers. If Nate's video was correct, so. Maybe I should grab the set of my set of power armor in Diamond City. I don't know. Hi, how are ya? I'm new around here. I wanted to personally thank you for giving us this opportunity. No worries. Any Michelle. place you want me to pitch in? Mm, not right not now. Not right now. Thanks. Alright then. You're gonna be on a trading route soon, though. I could use the... Immersive Motorcycle Mod. Go to Diamond City and then... Diane? And then walk from there to, to Quincy. But, uh, eh. Let's do it the, the hard way. <clears throat> Thanks a lot. You showed up just in the nick of time. No problem. Look, you look, looking uh, for a new place to settle? Could be. Why? Do you know somewhere good? Uh, I sure do. Goes to Abernathy. Thanks. See you there in a day or two. Yeah. It's way closer than that, though. Maybe. Probably. 
I should have. Some gear to give her, but I don't. So, yeah. <laughs> Let's just hope she gets that alright. I haven't finished the chain of thoughts about my mood. Even now, have I? Until now, have I? Anyways. I don't know, things are just too complicated. I don't wanna really talk about it. Nah. Right now, at least. But, uh. You know how it is, like. Family, or better, or better saying, blood relations. Nope. Nope. Yes. Oh, come on, I'll bring another. Nice. What is it, boy? Let me save the game, though. I don't know, I'll probably make one hell of a good. As I was going to say, I'm probably making some heal just cuts. Unless some shit happens, you know, between here and uh, and Quincy. And probably will happen, but uh, anyways. You know, I was playing for 40 minutes, maybe thinking it was recording, but for some reason, it wasn't. <sighs> um, nothing really important happened. I just cleared this place out. Died once <laughs> in the process. carry this at least and this not this though Piper hey point the way don't mind the clutter yeah that's actually <laughs> time
I wonder why That's it. OBS just stops. It stops like out of nowhere, you know. Who knows though? <clears throat> uh, it's raining. Oh, wow. Let's make our way to Quincy. Oh, what the f <clears throat> Anyways, I'm almost maxing out my relationship with Piper. Soon enough, I'll have her perk. I don't know. Guess I start walking with Preston after that. Or maybe... I still have to get Nick. But to get Nick, I have to do the quest. And not really in the mood for that. Nice. I just hope it don't crash again. I was in a really good mode. And this and the game was supposed to keep me in that good mode, you know. Yes. Please, you gotta help me. Uh, what? what are you doing here? They grabbed me when I was on watch. I'm pretty sure they're getting ready to kill me. Please, you gotta help. Um. Uh... Don't worry. I'll get you out of here. Oh my God! Thank you. Let's go. <clears throat> yes. Mm, nothing. Now, who is this chick, though? And that's an ugly ass motherfucker. Hey, on the waste otherwise. Come on, dog meat, stop. Jesus. Now Where's the other one? Maybe getting the... That bug collision 
mod was stupid of me. Just maybe, you know. Uh, let me ignore those gunfires. It's not my problem. I really need to stick with a plan at least once in a, in this series, you know. I really, 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 really want to know what's the fucking problem with this, with OBS. Is the fifth time in, the ro in a row it like it just stops recording or only gods know why <sighs> and it is really getting on my nerves, you know. Got it. Well, if anyone could figure out a good use for it. <laughs> Time to start drop, start starting shit on, on Piper. would be an expert locker ooh a flamer that's fine hey just let me know sure take a peek carry this please where's my junk there you go getting full either I should sell all these mods though, don't know why I'm carrying them around What I also need to do is find a bed that I can use Sensor alert, anomaly detected Ooh. Reveal yourself. And if I don't want to, but let me. Over here, watch yourself. That motherfucker can get in nice. bone. Really? Jesus. Uh, no, I guess I haven't bought a <laughs> assault drone. What the actual fuck? 
Bruh. Like, bruh. I mean, how and why? The heck? I should stop with the harding, but I can't. What was that? Good riddance. That was a minor alert. A couple of them actually. Hmm. Let's go up. And I really got scared by this. Oh well. Now, how that SO Trump killed me? I have no idea. And I will be thinking about this for a solid while. the fuck okay you know what i'm going to here i'm going to diamond city no detours from diamond city i'm gonna make a quick trip to sanctuary tie around the couple stuff and all what the fuck was that oh, come on Well, there's a classic. Nothing there now. What do you think? Let me <laughs> at least change the the place where it's safe the game. I don't. Oof. I can't stand that place anymore. This one, not this one, nope, nope, yep. I said I would walk around with less guns, but here I am again. Hey, this isn't the place where I found Kellogg. No. Hey, Scava, let's trade. Um, sure. Let's see what you have. This motherfucker almost has no money. That's all right. Should I take the hit? Oh, whatever. Here. Let me take that.
was just five five hundred caps. My bird, my god! Hey, I swear I must be going crazy out there. Thanks, man, Ali. Oh, interesting. Why there is a super mutant there, though? What do I want? Yeah, this. And three points in here. I can't let the vehicle back. Where did the little bitch go? Check something. <laughs> okay, it is it's still recording. Nice. Yeah. How about something a little more challenging next time? <laughs> Is this place mine now? Or no, I still have someone else to kill? This place is mine. I won't be playing with it right now, of course. That will be... happen on a settlement episode but hey holy fuck but hey it's cool that uh, I found days, it. Hasn't it 
and it works sort of uh it worked better saying sort of uh uh how it's called Yeah. Hey, something's out there. Thank you. I wonder if this is normal for other journalists. Hello, spot. Where is your your owner, though? Oh. Motherfucker. Okay, this is just a guard. Don't scare me like that, you... Man, I almost shot him. Thanks to its silver. Why am I still in danger? Yeah, and not really. Oh, that's okay. Now I won't go into a fence sewer because I wanna have Nick with me when I do that. Officer. But I kind of know what waits for me down there, you know. A shitload of holotapes and uh, and all that. Now I need to know where the fuck is Milton parking garage. There is something in there that I want. Uh oh. Uh oh. I'll be back in a minute. Now I'm almost getting a mod dela 
that allows me to hard save on, uh, on survival because yikes x1 Barbara armor locations followed for custom house tower I keep pressing the right mouse button to, to sprint and I don't really I'm not really playing Genshin that much anymore what is it boy imagine like if I was Jesus speaking of which there is an event going that you Somewhere. there is something to do with cats and uh, I really wanna I really need to play it, but... Fuck. It wasn't recording for some fucking reason. I swear I click on the damn button. Well, at least they you gonna heard me searching for the location of a couple places. Boston Harbor. Okay, I'll be there later on. Uh, I'm getting a clue. Nope. No, this. Hello, Nat. Watch your back. The Institute could be right behind you. <laughs> hey, Nat. Hey, lady. That interview you did with Piper is really selling. Here's your free copy. Thank you. I'm gonna watch, I'm gonna read it in a minute. Blank, rib, or sirloin. They're all good, so, um, make up your mind. Uh, sure. I'll take a look. Sure. Check out these cuts. Mm, thank you for nothing, but thank you anyway. Hey, Doc. Let's get you examined right away. Time is not on the side of the surgeon. Yeah, uh... Actually, I need some supplies for the road. I suppose I could spare some stim packs. I don't have that much money, but I really have two of these. Don't know where I neither of them, but I have. Thank you. The hub of trade for all Diamond City right here. Self-prescribed Kim is recommended by me, myself, and Got I. some great stuff, if you're interested. Sure, let's, let's see what you out. have. Don't forget to stock up on ammo. Yeah, that's exactly why I'm here. Hold on. Uh, fusion cars, thank you. Linear fuel. Some carn, what the fuck? Mm. Yeah, let me see if I can have I can sell him some shit. Mm. 
Well, I don't need this anymore, so. Thank you. I ain't telling you how to pick your friends. But Piper is kind of a troublemaker. Shut up. Protection for sale! Mama. Hand you again. Alright, got plenty of supplies. Sure. Let's take a look. A bit of everything. Mm hmm. I'm interested in this though. Whoa, nice. Some fifty cow, this one chill. Some fusion shells, why not? Some plasma oh mm, my aid. Take this, 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 this. I don't do melee, so whatever. Okay, do you have any more that I can take? This. Um, some 556. Five, five, some railway rail. That thing. Let me see. This one. Yeah. Thought so. Take this, take this. I don't need that much on me. Thank you. I had this one. That's right. Hold on, let me. Heads up. What you got for me? Shoot. I need you to get out of your power armor. You got it. I completely forgot I had. I have. Sad. Look alive. Point the way. Yep. Now this one. Going to here. And this one is coming with me. Now, if I really want to have some fun. Where is the head, though? Look alive. Yeah, I'm carrying a lot of shit, but that's okay.
don't don't get in my way. Mm, actually. Let's go, sure. Wait, why isn't? Hmm. Oh, whatever. I really wanna a how it's called that rifle. Whatever. You want that use this ammo. I really want that, you know. Hey, I just wanted to introduce myself. We heard oh. people talking about your radio beacon, so we figured we'd give it a try. Nice. I wanted to personally thank you for giving us this opportunity. No problem. So let me know if you have anything you need me to do. Not right now. Not right now. Thanks. All right. Just let me know. Sure thing. I would throw them in there, but nah. Just aren't you? Just whatever. Now let's go for 10 hours sleep. My character sure does sleep way better than I do. I'm parched, but I will be fixed. Fix it. In a second. I'll hand it to you. This place isn't awful. It's still a hole, but it could be worse. Man, how I wish I could blow her head off. My power armor. Oh, okay. Save the game. Grab his neck. Now, whatever. Let me just. I'd like to trade some items. Go ahead. Cut off my house. Sorry, boy. Yeah, let me turn off the the steam grainer. There you go. Now, I really wanna... 
make this on this video i really wanted to but uh, and guess what tell you what i'll just go whatever it is probably already the file i mean it's probably a really big as fuck but um i can make the one during the editing process you know okay i need to eat and drink something where's my there we go I should have taken up so I could save, but that's all right. Uh, you know, when there is nothing to do with the game, but you know, someone's voice just annoys you like deeply. Yeah, that's me with this motherfucker that lives here. I'm so sick of him, I'm so Ugh. Anyway, let me shut up about it. Like I... Like I said earlier, although now I'm not so sure if it was caught on, a, on camera. But... Blood, re blood relations can be a, a real thing, you know? See if I already have her. It's K. Yep. Ooh, I leveled. I leveled up in some. Let me see the gift I got. I already have it. Nope. No problem. What do I want? This. I told myself I wouldn't go for a stealth build, but, eh. well. Hold on. Oh no.
I do hope I just get you, Quincy. Soon enough. Without having too much problem. With what that thing was fighting. Oh, an albino red scorpion. Holy fuck. Question: What is the difference between potato chips and potato crisps? This probably is just more of a language barrier, but still, you know. Super green dumbs motherfuckers. That is what is out there. Yeah, human, human, human. Got a treat for you. Sorry, Pi Piper.
Yeah, I'm pretty aware of that, thank you. Talk about spray and play. Spray and pray. We are the future. Nah. I kind of forgot that I had died, you know, after getting the that flamer. I really wish I had with me though, just to have some fun. Now I promise I'm really going to the... To the... The castle. I got two laser. This is an emergency message to all Commonwealth Army soldiers. Well, emergency protocol 17 Echo Charlie Diner are in effect. If you are in distress, please proceed to the South Boston Military Checkpoint for aid. Coordinates are available in your emergency handbook. Holy hell. This safe house is for military personnel only. This is including non-military family members. Need you to carry some stuff for me, boy. This. This. And this. 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 Mm, no. 
give me this back. Come on out. This checkpoint has been designated as a safe house in case of enemy invasion and is currently stocked with additional food, water, and ammunition. <laughs> South Boston. Ooh. This message will repeat. Oh fuck. Yeah, they're not interested in sharing, huh? Because in bullets, nice. Why do it keep me fed? <laughs> now, can I turn this fucking this thing is off? Jesus fucking Christ. This checkpoint has been designated as a safe house in case of enemy invasion and is currently stocked with additional food, water, and ammunition. No. Um, looks like I can't. Well, at least I found a colonial tie. And uh, if I'm in South Boston, I'm where I wanna be here. Huh? If I wasn't in Farag armor, this would be so much harder. <laughs> oh hell, I don't believe I snorted. Oh, uh. I don't really like these perks, especially this one. It makes so much a mess. You bet. Where is she though? I can hear that bitch but I don't know what, where the where she is.
Bingo. Thanks. I've done this hundreds of times. You think you'll be any different? Huh. Where though? I heard it, but I can't see. Oh, there you go. Hey, something. Oh, you game plus me, huh? Uh, 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 uh. Well, away to find out I was out of grenade. I need a mattress, a sleeping bag, or anything, really. Hey, boy. Thank you. Let's go for a good eight hours of sleep. You know, I really wish I could get you to the castle without much trouble, but <laughs> looks like he is asking too much, you know. Parker Queen. Should I know who you are? Hi. Pardon me, ma'am. Parker Quinn. I just wanted to say, it's a good thing you came by my corner. Yeah? yeah? Why is that? Because I got something you need. Seriously, I can tell you need it. You know how I know? Just because you're here. If a lady stays alive in the Commonwealth, enough to go walking through Southie, she got her affairs in order. You know your shit. It's true. I do know my shit. Oh, I like you. You got a mouth like a native and I bet a brain to match. Means you know a good thing when you see one. You remind me of this guy I knew from Dorchester. Ah, but I regress. Look, because you're obviously a busy, dangerous, and exceedingly intelligent person, I'm gonna cut right to it. I'm gonna make you a proposition so spectacular you can't possibly say no. You ready? Mm -mm. Something tells me you don't care either way. Every day you're gonna buy stuff. Food, ammo, beer, whatever. And you pay with caps. Caps, bottle caps. What is this, fucking 1612? A bunch of losers blow up the world 200 years ago, and we have to lug around piles of bottle caps? Are you friggin' kidding me? So that's why 
I've been working with every single shop in the Commonwealth to get rid of caps. Introducing the only form of currency you'll ever need, the charge card. The charge card? That's what I said, charge card. It's super simple. You give me 110 caps right now, and I give you this charge card. Accepted at any store in the Commonwealth, up to 100 caps. The 10 extra caps is my service fee. So what do you say? Want one? You're out of your mind. Well, I'm sorry you feel that way. But hey, it's your loss. Change your mind, you know where to find me. Retard. Don't call me that. Hey, scavenger. <laughs> Piper actually liked that? <laughs> there it is. Nice try! The heck was that sound? The green at restaurant. Do I know? Life is so much easier with this thing. We need river grip. I don't know how to say that. For the love of God, don't. All on the water. Thank you. I still think the power armor makes the game too easy, especially after that shootout. Uh, I'd rather do with that. Private Washington, Private Bennett. Everyone's here, General. There it is. Pretty impressive, huh? Its real name is Fort Independence. But the Minutemen always just called it the castle. Now you can see why I wanted to take it back. Maybe. Those walls could definitely use some work. I'll admit, it's seen better days. But the Minutemen have never been afraid of hard work. Our primary objective is to clear the courtyard. That's where we should see the most opposition. The wall on this side is the most exposed. But if we circle around south, we could also reach the main gate. What are we waiting for? Let's just get in there and shoot those lobsters. No. If we split up, we can flank them from both sides. It'll be like shooting fish in a barrel. Why not let them come to us? We set up a firing line on this side and you can draw them out. Well, General, what do you think? Set up a firing line and I'll draw them out. You can't do this alone. I'm coming with you. Sounds good. Better. We'll hold back and wait for them to come to us. Just don't get yourself trapped in there. <laughs> All right, people. You heard the general. 
Let's move out. Try not to draw their attention until we're in position. Mm. Yeah. Whatever. <laughs> I really hate this little guys. You know. Another issue of guns and bullets. But now, where's the queen coming up? Good thing it was a, <laughs> a Molotov and I got Nuka one. I 
wonder how Piper would deal with Where's the motherfucker thing though? Is this thing? Yeah, it is. Okay. the queen's corpse though Yeah, I still wanna know where the fuck is the queen's first. There it is. Once I power this up, we'll be ready to broadcast. Oh, right, I need to. Ah, it's too much things on the on the screen, I'm getting lost. No, that's cool. Where is the general? Corpse, though. Yeah, uh, I must be missing something, you know. supposed to be on the rooftop but okay it worked oh sorry mm. Hey there. Wow, we really did it. 
I've been watching the men and men fall to pieces for so long, I just... This is really something. <laughs> now we've got to pay off on what we've started. Bring the whole Commonwealth together and make it last this time. So, you know, back to business. But with Radio Freedom up and running, we can broadcast alerts to you anywhere, anytime. Broadcasting all day, all across the Commonwealth. Yeah. Attention, Minute <clears throat> Is there something you need? How are you feeling? I'm glad to have the chance to return the favor. After all the help you gave me. No problem, buddy. I've got buddy. something a bit different for you. Our scouts have found a promising spot for a new settlement. The trouble is that some kind of vicious beasts are lairing there. Once you clear it out, set up a radio beacon to let settlers know about it. Sure. Before you know it, we'll have a thriving new farm instead of wasteland. We'll take back the Commonwealth, one piece at a time. You sure? We sure will. Hey. Over here. I'm here, buddy. Ooh, you got it. And hold on, I mean it. Hey. I really need you. <laughs> Good, reloads all this shit I'm carrying, bro. Now I carry some of this for me for the love of God. This is Radio Freedom, voice of the Minutemen. Thank you, buddy. Hey. Attention, hmm? Minutemen. Piper. Who are you? Found a minute for me yet? If you are in the area, please respond. Is something up? Well, yeah, but it's nothing bad. Just what you said about Nat. I've been going over it again and again in my head, and what you said was right. Family's too precious. What kind of life is she going to have if I never go near her again? It's just... Sometimes it feels like the only things I've got in life are Nat and the paper. Having someone I can count on, someone like you, it's meant a lot to me. Not a lot of people want to hang around with the nosy reporter. Do people actively avoid you? Well, yeah. I mean, I didn't exactly start the paper to make friends. I just wanted to write the things I thought were wrong. And when Nat and I first got to Diamond City, there was a lot of wrong. Crooked guards, lousy infrastructure. <laughs> there was a hole in the exterior wall that was patched over with a bookcase. One bookcase. That's it. I started the paper more as an act of desperation than anything else. Turned out I wasn't the only one who wanted things to change. After the first couple of editions, people may not have agreed with what I said, but everyone was listening. Seriously? One bookcase, not even some tape? No, but now, now you can't even tell where the hole was. Brick, real mortar, the works. All because of the paper. When it's that first edition hit the stands, I felt Stay like safe. I'd finally done something worth doing. But afterwards, things... Things changed. People didn't want to talk the way they used to. It seemed that overnight I'd gone from being Piper, friend and confidant, to Piper, the nosy snoop. A lot of folks, they haven't treated me the same since. I started to feel like the only person I could count on was my little sis. You can count on me, Piper. I know I can. You're not afraid of me like everyone else. Mm. I was sure that the paper would be the best thing I ever did in my life, but being here with you now, now I don't know. I've needed someone like you in my life for a long time, Blue. I just never expected I'd actually get them. So thank you for being the friend I can count on. I feel the same way. There's no one I'd rather have watching my back. And I'll be there for you. As long as you'll have me. Now, come on. Let's hit the road. Where the fuck is Preston, bro? Is he back to Sanctuary, maybe? I 
sniper. This is Radio Freedom, the voice of the minute hey. Point the way. It's 1 a.m. Of course. All's quiet across the Commonwealth. Stay safe out there. Yeah, uh... Resources. Miscellaneous. Leather. You gotta be fucking kidding me. I need one fucking leather. Hey, what you got for me? Dogme. Look alive. Come on. You see? No fucking way. I sure hope I have say I saved after the talk with Piper. I don't want to go through over that dialogue again. Anyways, I'm gonna end this episode here. When next we come back, I'm gonna be with Preston instead of Piper, since I already got her perk, and uh, I don't know, maybe. Maybe I will finally take the. I finally attack on on the general the atomics thing since it is right man. here. You know, stay safe, stay hydrated, with your parents. You know this stuff. See you guys. See you guys on our next one. What is it? Hey. I've still got something I want to tell you, if you've got a minute. What is it? When we first met, I admit, I had my d but you've done nothing but impress me. You're just who the Minutemen needed to bring us back from the brink. I'm not sure I'm all that, Preston. You don't give yourself enough credit. When I was a kid, the Minutemen were my heroes. They were the only good guys around, really. When I turned 17, I joined up with Ezra Hollis's company. He was one of the good ones. Really believed in the old time Minuteman way. We had a few good years there. I felt like I was part of something bigger than me. Like I was really helping make the Commonwealth a better place. It sounds like you were really making a difference. I think we were. I know we were but obviously it didn't last. I'm sure there was a lot I didn't see or know enough to pay attention to. You know, the politics and rivalries and bad blood between the different groups. I guess General Becker was able to keep a lid on it, keep everyone more or less on the same team. But after he was killed, it all came out in the open. I couldn't believe it at first. These guys were supposed to be Minutemen. They were supposed to put their duty to the people ahead of everything else. You probably think I was pretty naive, huh? I guess I was. Still am, too. Even after everything. I still believe that the Minutemen can be what I always thought they were. The good guys. We are the good guys. We're doing our best. And a lot of it has to do with your example. So I guess what I'm trying to say is, thanks. Anyway, I appreciate you taking the time to listen. Anytime, Preston. Thanks. We'd probably better get back to it.